and welcome back to Let's Play Metroid, Episode 5. Okay, here we are again. I was so young. It was like an hour ago. I say, time really flies when you're making videos. So that's actually really violent, actually, now that I think about it. Uh oh. Anyone else interested in, like, the physics of how this is happening? Are these, like, a bunch of little, like, paving stones are able to stay up? Oh, no one put an asshole over here. Okay, we can either go down or up. Generally speaking, down is usually the way that they want you to go, I think. I, I don't actually know. We're back here again. Metal, 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 metal. Whoa, whoa, these things are different. Okay, what's the damage? Thirty. I don't like you. There's nowhere close. That's that's such an assholey thing. Like again, I don't expect my tanks to be filled. But... At least this is here. So I guess that's not actually as assholey. Because there's actually a spot to get your life back. But if I die here... Speaking of which... Speaking of which... Okay, uh, for whatever reason, I was like, yeah, it definitely died on that spot. Uh, I mean, it's not as bad as a GameCube controller, I guess. The clicking, I mean. So I guess funny, isn't it? Technically, my first true introduction to the Metroid series is going to be Metroid 1. Because originally it was going to be Prime, but then I decided, hey, this is a... Because originally these were going to be in a, as a, counting as a Wii U game. So actually, I should also mention, this is actually the first game that is actually being played in... So how I'm doing it is, I order my games by, um, like, you know not like buying order but like put them in like my collection and buy, 
my um my console date release. Uh -oh. So originally these were gonna this and also Earthbound was gonna be um a Wii U title considering, but then I'm like, yeah, let's just call it NES. So technically this is the first one in a true NES game. So I mentioned if we get if we get Metroid One. Actually, I think there's a Game Boy Advance version of this I saw, so I'll also be doing that eventually, maybe. I don't know. If you guys want me to play, uh, well, get a certain game for my collection and then I will play it uh, eventually, um, just let me know so then I can know that that's what you guys want to see eventually. Like, when I mean eventually, I don't, I'm not get. an actual time frame, but as opposed to possibly in 10 years, maybe. You can hold down B for a reason. Is there a limit? I think there might actually be a limit to how much health and missiles I can get. Definitely, if there was a limit, we definitely hit it. So let's refresh it by going back in. Yep, they definitely refreshed it. Oh boy, did it refresh it. As in, yes it did. It's, you know, it's a saying. It's not even a saying. It's a mannerism in speech. So are certain enemies more likely to give you 20? HPs, because I feel like that's a thing, like the jumpers that are now mechanical versions of themselves, I guess. So I guess another thing that's a reskin. You're kidding me, right? Like it just didn't want to give me. I think it's. I don't know why it's doing that. It's like you've had enough health. Okay. Not this again. Whatever. Better safer than sorry. I still wish you could crouch and then turn into a ball. I don't like how it doesn't only knock you up, but it also blasts you away, you know, like an actual explosion, I suppose. I guess I could just get below them. Good job, me. Good job, me. Isn't this game not canon anymore or something? Because 
doesn't Zero Mission replace this game as being the canonical first game? I can actually hurt you. This is like the instance where that like red horseshoe crab can technically be hurt. Not really. Down here. So that works. Bouncing straight up. There's one way of doing it. No. Okay, they're not coming anymore, though I'm fine with that. Thanks. Okay. Ow. Oh great, now you attracted attention to the other one. Kidding me? Just let me through, please. Oh, yeah, I can't even get back up. Oh, my God. This is not fun. Now we get to back, go back up and grind more! Yay! really hope I don't get myself killed here. If I do, it's all the way back to the very beginning of the game. And we're at this one again, already. I guess this is a more safer way. No, 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 no. It'd be sort of nice if if I die here. Ah, oh, fuck it.
please don't. Just keep on bouncing in between this room and that. So in the end, I'm actually hurting myself even more. Actually let them get all the way like up. That's when they stop dropping. I'm not gonna leave till I get full health. Doesn't mean I won't end the episode. Our suit be like a lot of other suits where like the shields regen. Because an energy tank is for shields, isn't it? grinding and then you get the next episode which is also going to start off with grinding. There we go. One more energy. Well, because there's my primary energy tank as well. If I was actually good at this game and able to speedrun it, I would be done by now. Apparently it's like two hours as a speedrun time, at least on how long to beat. Save my welcome. Well, 
Yep, I'm pretty sure I've definitely overstayed my welcome here, so... I guess that's gonna be it. So, if you enjoyed this video of, uh... Did we even progress in this video? I don't know. But... I'm going to create a restore point. Yes! And... That's gonna be it. So... If you enjoyed this video, you know what to do. See ya.